Hey guys, on the previous video, I was talking about purchasing the 50th anniversary emblems for the rear. I finally, I got them for the wheels, uh, the center caps, but I wasn't able to get the trunk and the hood. I finally received them. Um, I've been looking almost daily, trying to find what site will have them. And I was able to find it on paddleshifters.com. It came from Germany. And uh, the, fre uh, the BMW dealer told me that it won't be here maybe until October. And if you do an online order and it doesn't come in with them within a month, it cancels itself if you order it from online. So uh, I'll just cancel it if it comes anyway. But I was finally able to get it on um, paddleshifters.com. It came in today. It took less than a week to send because I, uh, I got the uh, expedited shipping. And this was the box that it came in. I kind of put tools in here that I might need to uh, remove it the, the emblems but it was kind of funny in the box uh, they also included gummies thought that was kind of funny never seen that before but they gave me some candy from germany I'm not sure if it's made in germany possibly i don't know if you guys can see the wording on there but anyways not we're not talking about the candy here so we're uh the emblems look uh, identical so i'm assuming that they're the same uh for the trunk and the rear i don't see a difference and i didn't see any labeling indicating that one is for the trunk and one is for the hood they both look identical they both have these um uh stickers uh on the back so let's try to remove it and let's see how that's gonna go I've watched some YouTube videos on how they remove the emblems. But let's see if I can remove it successfully. So what I'm going to do is put some ta uh, tape on the bottom and just ply it out with the... Uh, I'm going to ply it out with the flathead. Uh, because there was a video showing that they put like a zip tie underneath and they were able to just pull it out but this looks like they have tape all around so that's not going to work on this car and I think that was a 4 series so I'm not sure if the emblems are come different on those cars hopefully we don't scratch up any of the paint like I said just gonna put this and this thing's probably gonna fly at my face this video should probably be labeled how not to remove your emblem There we go. Just a little bit of force. And since this car is fairly new, it's a 21. So this tape is gonna be easy to take off. All I'm gonna do is just peel it off. Um, as you can see, I did damage the old emblem, but I'm not gonna use it anyway, so I don't really care. So let's just try to take this off really quick. So I've been looking on Auto Technique and where I usually buy the parts for this V uh, uh, accessories, but they, they've been sold out for a while. So let me try to get a A trim removal kit. I have a trim removal kit. Let me see if this is gonna make it a little easier to take off. There we go. As long as I get most of it off, that'll be fine. <laughs> 